Hi friends, this is Dr. Mahindran, author of Forensic Medicine Nothing Beyond. Very happy to meet you all. I should thank you for all the great support which you have given me in the last edition. At this juncture, I would be very glad to share with you that we are coming out with the latest edition of Forensic Medicine Nothing Beyond, the third edition. You can see this is the edition which have been updated with all the latest questions, all the latest concepts. You can see the contents are arranged in a structured manner. It starts with the theory part. The theory with full of concepts. You can see many tables, many flowcharts, many mnemonics. I have also given you many illustrative case studies. These illustrative case studies will not only make to, to understand the concepts better, it will also make the learning interesting. The next chapter, next section would be MCQs. I have incorporated all the latest MCQs in this with detailed explanations. Then we go on to image based questions. I have given you plenty of images which are necessary to crack all the exams. Then the most important section, the chapter at a glance. This is most important because I have given you all the concepts of the chapter arranged in a flowchart manner. You can revise the entire concepts of that chapter just at a glance. And then we go to the online section. I have given you online for all the chapters. Students found this very, very productive for all the exams. This will be very useful for your revision process. So friends, I will tell you how to decode this book. See, the preparation will be having two important phases. The first phase is reading. The second phase would be revision. The reading phase is very crucial because this is where you are going to get all the concepts clarified and this is where you are going to assimilate all the concepts. The more time you spend on the reading process, you are going to lessen the time which you are going to spend for the revision process. In this reading phase, the first phase, you are going to read all the theory, you are going to get all the concepts inside, highlight the points which you feel they are important. After learning the concepts, go through the MCQ section, solve all the MCQs. Right? After solving all the MCQs, go through the explanations and mark all the questions which have gotten it wrong, which is very, very important for the revision process. Right? After this, the second phase comes, the revision phase. Again, we can split the revision phase into two. The first phase of revision will be one month before the exams. The second phase of revision will be one week before the exams. Just one month before the exams, we are going to see, we are going to learn all the highlighted areas from the theory part. Also, we are going to learn all the MCQs which have gotten it wrong in the previous time. Right? And then you go to the image based questions, read all the explanations. Right? And then comes part two of your revision that is just one week before the exams. In that phase, you are going to learn only the onlineers. You are going to just see the chapter at a glance. Right? Nothing more than that. With this, you will, your revision process would be complete right you have learnt and you have revised your preparation is complete i can assure you that learning from this book will not only be interesting would also be enjoyable my best wishes i hope you all crack the exams with flying colors thanks a lot